Brought to you by wikivd.com Carl Ikeem Carl Onora Ikeem is a professional footballer who plays as a goalkeeper for Championship Club Wolverhampton Wanderers and the Nigeria national team. He has previously played on loan at Accrington Stanley, Stockport County, Charlton Athletic, Sheffield United, Queen's Park Rangers, Leicester City, Middlesbrough, and Doncaster Rovers. In July 2017 it was announced that Ikeem has been diagnosed with acute leukemia. Wolverhampton Wanderers Ikeem progressed through Wolverhampton Wanderers Academy and made the first team squad in the 2003-04 Premier League season. Due to Matt Murray's long-term injury, he was promoted to the substitutes bench for a string of games, but never played. First loan moves to gain first-team action, he moved on loan to League Two side Accrington Stanley. He made senior debut on 16 October 2004 when he played the first of four games for them, keeping a clean sheet at Aldershot Town. He also had a further loan move to Stockport County in autumn 2005 which was cut short due to a hand injury. Wolves breakthrough. He finally made his Wolves debut the following season, in a 5-1 win over Chester City in the League Cup on 23 August 2005. However, although often on the bench, he had to wait until 26 August 2006 for his first league appearance for the club when he appeared as a late substitute in a 1-0 win over Luton Town. Ikeem suffered a knee injury during the 2006-07 season and had to undergo surgery, which kept him out of contention until late 2007. After recovering, he was an unused substitute, or only employed in reserve team fixtures. It was not until September 2008 that he got his chance to return to Wolves' first team after regular keeper Wayne Hennessy was suspended. Impressing, he enjoyed his longest run of games in a Wolves shirt until injury ruled him out for the remainder of the season, during which the club went on to claim the championship and reach the Premier League. Championship load spells. After regaining fitness, he joined League One side Charlton Athletic on a month's loan in October 2009 to cover for injured Robert Elliott, making five appearances. Upon the end of this loan, he immediately went out on loan again, this time to Championship side Sheffield United for a month but a hamstring injury halted his stay. He recovered from this setback and was again sent out on loan to a championship club, this time Queen's Park Rangers during January 2010, where he made 17 appearances. In August 2010, he again went out on loan when he joined Leicester City on a one-month emergency deal as cover for injured keeper Chris Wheel. This spell was later extended, but ended when the Foxes recruited Chris Kirkland at the end of November, after four appearances by Ikeem. He spent the remainder of the 2010-11 season back at Wolves. Ikeem completed a one-month loan move to Championship side Middlesbrough in August 2011, after impressing in a pre-season trial. This loan deal was extended for a further month in August, and then for a third and final month until the 1st of November. He kept six clean sheets in ten games before a hand injury saw him return to Molyneux. Once recovered, he had a loan spell at another championship side. When he joined Doncaster Rovers in November 2011, he made five appearances for the club as they struggled at the foot of the table before the deal expired in January. 
He returned to them once again in March 2012, joining on an initial one-month loan deal, later extended to run until the end of the season. However, he was recalled by Wolves following an injury to first-choice goalkeeper Wayne Hennessy. By this point, Doncaster had been confirmed as relegated to League One under his future Wolves manager Dean Saunders. Return to Wolves Ikeem made his first appearance for Wolves since January 2009 on the final day of 2011-12, coming on as a substitute for Doris De Vries in the 51st minute of a 3-2 loss to Wigan Athletic at the DW Stadium on 13 May 2012. This was Terry Connor's last game in charge of Wolves before being replaced by Stale Solbakken, who gave Ikeem his most consistent run in the first team so far. Ikeem started the 2012-13 season as Wolves' first-choice goalkeeper in the championship following Injuries to Wayne Hennessy and Doris De Vries, he maintained his place in the first team. When the latter returned in September 2012, in March 2013 he conceded a bizarre own goal during a league game against Bristol City, when he allowed a David Davis back pass to go between his legs and roll over the line. Ikeem was substituted at half-time and it was later confirmed that he had broken his hand during the interval by punching a tactics board in the dressing room in frustration at the incident. This injury kept him out for the remainder of the season, which ended in relegation to League One. Ikeem retained the goalkeeping position at Wolves for the 2013-14 season, excelling in a 3-0 win over Colchester United at the Colchester Community Stadium on 5 October 2013, when he saved a late penalty from Freddie Sears. However, he again suffered a broken hand when he was injured in a collision against Tranmere on 1 January 2014. He returned to Wolves' goal now as the established first choice, following the sale of Wayne Hennessy and was a part of the team that won the League One title with a record points tally. After keeping 22 clean sheets across the season, Ikeem was named in the PFA League One Team of the Year alongside four other teammates. Once back in the championship, Ikeem impressed at the start of 2014-15, keeping five clean sheets in the first eight games during which he saved an O in Garvan penalty in a 1-0 win over Bolton Wanderers on 20 September 2014 at Molineux. During the 2016-17 season, Ikeem extended his current deal, ensuring he is contracted to Wolves until summer 2020. The goalkeeper received his first career red card on 21 January 2017 in a league match at Norwich City, when Wolves appealed against it, the suspension was reduced from three matches to two. Thank you for watching. Brought to you by wikivd.com. Please like and subscribe below. Please like and subscribe below.